now that we're back in Bangkok, we are taking the opportunity to visit some old favorites and explore new places we've never seen before. Today, we're showing you some of the many reasons why Bangkok is so amazing. Good morning. Today we are in the Tonburi side of Bangkok, which is a bit to the west of the river. We're in Talapu Market, which is a place we've been before with Gary Butler, the roaming cook. It's very early in the morning right now. It's about 10. Well, that's not actually that early. But there's usually more market stores here in the night, but we are going to grab a coffee here and some snacks before we do some exploring. All right, let's see if I can order this. <laughs> one. 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 I'm not gonna mess that one up. I like a sweet. One. <laughs> I think I did a good job. They're laughing. I don't know if that's like, oh, she knew what she was saying or like, what? <laughs> Uh, okay. Two hot coffees. Start the day. <laughs> Cheers. We asked for a one, which means sweet. Now I know a lot of you watching will be like, "What? Things are already so sweet here." We like our coffee very sweet. Strong coffee, sweet coffee, delicious. I grew up not liking coffee, but I think it's because I never put any sugar or milk or anything like that in there. Uh, now I like it. So. <laughs> we found the perfect formula. Just loads Sweet, of sugar. Strong. Yes. <laughs> Woo. I don't know what the sign says, so hopefully that doesn't say, don't speak to me. <laughs> There's a smiley face. So. Yeah, so it's like, don't speak to me. <laughs> Um, uh, make me say, please smile. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah, so we've had these kanembang multiple times. We've actually also specifically had these exact ones, and they're very good. How many do you want, my love? Um, just get four. four. Can I have uh, four? It's, How do you say? How do you say four? Uh, C. C. <laughs> kanembang. Um, Sweet, 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 sweet. Ha. <laughs> the reason they ask if you want sweet or not sweet is because they actually also have a prawn version. They look very similar. They're not the same. Don't mess it up. <laughs> <laughs> the non-sweet ones are sweets as well, but they are made with shrimp. Um, so a little bit of a sort of umami taste to it, I guess. Pretty nice, but again, sweet stuff for us. I don't know 100% if these are actually kanumbang, because they look different to some of the ones we've tried in the past. Either that, or they can have different fillings. I know that they can have prawn and angel hair, AKA egg yolk, but these also have coconut and not that creamy white stuff. Look at that. It's probably too noisy here to actually hear how crispy this is when I tuck in, but here I go anyway. Mmm, mmm. Oh, that is so sweet. Mmm, sorry. This is so good. The coconut meat in there, so tasty. The whole thing, super wholesome, super delicious. More of a dessert than a breakfast for sure, but when in Thailand, you've got to have snacks. Yeah, this stuff is so good. So to come here, you've obviously got to be appropriately dressed. I've got my shoulders covered, my chest pretty much fully covered, and my knees are covered. I'm good to go. So this is the first time we've actually put these masks on since being in Thailand, because we've seen that the mandate for masks has been removed, but probably 90% of the people we see are wearing masks, so 
Are you meant to be wearing one? Are you not? Then, I don't know. Please let us know. That Buddha statue is enormous. Yeah, <laughs> it's the biggest one I have ever seen. Whoa, it's so big, my eyes are hurting looking up. Yeah, it's so bright. Wow, wow it's so shiny and gold as well. Oh my God, that is cool. That is very cool. I didn't expect it to be that big. It's hard to see from photos, but if you, hold on, try to film me with the statue and people will maybe get a bit of a, That'll it's do it. Much taller than me. <laughs> so this is Wat Pak Nam Basi Charo in Bangkok. I think last time we were in Bangkok, it was just getting finished, so we didn't actually get a chance to see it. Wow, I'm glad we did. It is almost 70 meters tall and 40 meters wide. Massive. It's almost the height of a 20-floor building. It is beautiful. It is very impressive. There is also a actual temple here as well where people are praying so we're not going to go in there just because of disrespect we're not going to take the camera with us either stick it in people's faces so we're just going to sit here and appreciate how massive this thing is I, I actually can't see the top of it right now because it's so tall the roof of the building above us is blocking it I don't think I've been this amazed in a while because yeah. like with buildings like real skyscrapers you know you can see enter, yeah. that they've you know, they're square and they're built like the same over and over and over. But this is an actual statue of a it's Buddha that's carved artwork. out. Even his thumbnails are detailed. Very cool. Yeah. Very, very cool. Wow. This Buddha even looks immense from behind. Oh, oh could have really hurt myself badly then, but since my travel insurance is with Safety Wing, all my medical bills would have been covered. Now that we're back traveling full time, we're back with our favorite travel insurance, Safety Wing. Throughout the last two years, we've been using Safety Wing when we're outside of our home countries. One of our favorite features about Safety Wing is that it's so flexible. You don't even need to know which dates you're flying or where you're going, which is great for us because we always make last minute decisions about where to go. What's also great is there's no risk of forgetting to renew your policy since you can get a subscription online that you can cancel anytime. You can get your own policy from as little as five days with Safety Wing just using the link in the description box below. So you too can be enjoying the amazing Bangkok worry free. My job. My job. My job. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> After that tuk tuk ride, we're now in the sort of Chinatown area of Bangkok. Both of those tuk tuks cost 100 baht each. 
which is not so bad really for the sort of thrill of going super fast around these really fun streets of Bangkok. We've now come to my favorite time of the day, time for dessert. We are sat in a place called Bualoi Ket Kiel or Get Kiel. Not 100% sure how to say it. Bualoi Ket Kiel. Get Kiel. Get Kiel. Get Kiel. Get Kiel. <laughs> Good. And we're here for obviously the Bualoi. Now, Bualoi is my favorite Thai dessert. Mango sticky rice can go home. This is the winner every single day for me for numerous reasons. One, very affordable. Two, delicious, sweet, a little bit salty. It's got everything you want and it's hot, which you might not want on a hot day, but it's raining a little bit. It's perfect. So what Bualoi actually means in Thai is technically floating water lily or lotus. It's got these colorful floating balls inside which are made from rice flour um, and they're kind of like sticky, starchy. It's also got little bits of taro in there I'm pointing at and some corn. Also there's some coconut meat in there which you can see here and then we've got the sort of hot coconut milk which is sweet, sometimes a little bit salty. Oh, it's just so delicious. I've been talking about it for so long, I'm actually, <laughs> I just want to tuck in. Oh my God, that's so good. Oh, that's so good. That is really, really good. It's like sweet, a little bit salty, super creamy, warm. Oh, that is so good. If you haven't tried this, or if you think it looks kind of funny, just try it anyway. It is, you won't regret it. It's so tasty. It looks kind of strange, really. Um, but now that you've seen this video, you're gonna come to Thailand. You really have to try this, honestly. Oh my god. <laughs> sticky balls are so sticky. Well, oh that's better than I remember it. Mm. Or, this is better than any of the ones I've ever had before. Wow. But, this is why we love Bangkok. You can get history, culture, food at any corner. And if you love Bangkok as much as we do, then you'll want to watch the video on the screen next. <laughs>